Hi everyone, hope you're doing well. I uh, just wanted to share some useful information for new uh, brokers, uh, active brokers, uh, looking to research more information, get a helping hand in trying to understand um, common uh, trade terms, definitions. There'll be times where you'll talk to a client, even somebody else who's in the industry. Maybe you're trying to communicate with the lender, whoever it may be, and, and just something, some kind of terminology that gets thrown your way just goes right over your head. And you're trying to think, how do I... Uh, gather that information and understand this material so that moving forward I'm not lost on the topic without making myself look a little foolish and asking what does that mean when we're trying to appear professional in front of the client or our partnered lender or whatever it is. So a great resource is helpwithmybank.gov and here it can provide you with a lot of useful information to help you understand just a lot about loan brokering, specifically um, um, banking questions, terms, things that you might want to learn more about, right? Frequently asked questions, things like that. Now, here at ION, it, we actually uh, have lists of um, a lot of this information. For, so here's some common banking terms that you'll see, right? We have a list of these terms, right? Whether it be an affidavit, uh, an amortization, appraisal, so on and so forth, and down the list we go. And you'll be able to see definitions with links that actually launch and provide more context as to how that may work or whatever it is, right? So it's always useful to have information like this available to you when you're live on a call with a client, a lender, whoever. So if you don't understand what they're saying to you, you can just look it up, grab it, and then say, oh, okay, that's what they're talking about. Right? Be able to click and get some useful information, give it a scan while they're talking, and then respond to it, whatever it may be. Right. Same thing with common deal documents. Right. If we're talking about real estate and we're talking about info and, and, and docs that are required by lenders following acceptance of the quote or letter of intent, right? They may ask for a fix and flip track record or a rent roll lease agreement, right? Or personal financial statements or whatever it is. And you're going to want to have an example of these things. You're going to want to have a, a, a form that you can fill or a template or whatever it may be. We provide this stuff to our brokers so that and our students so that they have these things. But anyway, just wanted to share some useful information to help you on your journey, even if you don't sign up with ION, um, just to kind of help you as a resource um, in your journey to becoming a low broker, to improving as a loan broker. Uh, this is a great website, a great tool, and, and, and can uh, greatly assist you in your efforts. Anyway, thanks so much, everybody. The best of luck out there. Good luck to you, what, what's coming up here in the new year, 2022, right? So everybody hit the ground running and uh, go make some money, all right? Thanks so much. Take care.